island of Soldor, there's a branch line. The Farquhar branch, all the ends it seems so fine. Thomas to Thomas and Percy, they're best friends every day. Toby to guide and Mavis to the to and Toby to guide their way. Gordon and James right there on the main lawn, and the newest member, me alive. The engines all work hard every day. Night of hard adventures, every single day on the Northwestern Railway. The North and the Far Adventures on the Far Quad Branch. Bark Park Adventures On the island of Sodor there is a branch line. Without this branch line, the world would seem so unfit. It has a quarry. Where diesel runs it. Mm -mm. And they're the and their workmen deliver. Toby. Ding ding. Mm -mm. See you, Mavis. Later, Toby. Their postal and goods engine. Their post and goods engine. Percy. <laughs> All the indignity. And their tank engine. And Thomas the tank engine himself to pull his two faithful coaches, Annie and Clarabelle. The engines always work hard every day. Our story starts with Percy. Hey, a Percy. Hi, Thomas. What's wrong? You see, the mail service says they don't want steam engines to pull us anymore. They now want big and fat. They now want trucks to do the work. And I think that would be serving right, said said Gordon. You are just nothing but a puny little tank engine. <sighs> I'll have you here, Gordon, that, if that even is your name, that, that Percy has given us several smooth rides. What? Anything wrong? Nothing, Frank. Frank was one of his mail car's names. And Carly and Clyde. This will be my last mail run. I guess it will. What's going to happen to your mail cars? Frank, Carly, and, and Clyde. They're going to be scrapped. But I hope they can find another use for it. Oh, well. Oh well. The best of hopes hopes for you to keep the mail service on. I guess hopes for you from me too. But that was no to avail. Ding ding said. <sighs> What's wrong, Thomas? Percy's losing his 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 job. He's not going to pull the mail. Oh dear! Percy loves the mail train. Ever since he was given it back when he joined the Northwestern. Yes. I wish there was some way to help him. Yeah, I wish too. <sighs> or the time. <sighs> <sighs> Meanwhile, while Percy was pulling his mail train, just two more stops and we'll be done. Miss you two, three. Don't worry. That's odd. Clyde, yes? The brakes are not. We're, we're getting up Gordon's hill. Lower the brakes. Okay. What? Clyde, yes? We're coming up on a hill. I know, but I can't seem to let my brakes go on. I'll try turning on mine. 
Oh no! Our, we forgot to put brake fluid in our. We forgot. There's no brake fluid. It's all used up. Oh dear. Which means. Ah! The person soon raced down the tracks like a rocket. So there should be some way that we can help t Percy <gasps> run away. Oh no, Jeremy! Yes, Toby. Go alert the signal. Go to the telephone in the station and alert the signalman. Thomas, you try to stop him. Okay, Toby. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should try and stop Percy like I did with James. Hopefully this time it will work. Couple me up, couple me up," said Thomas. "I gotta stop Percy. Keep trying, keep trying, but it was too late. Ah! Ah! Oh no! I gotta hurry. Percy's going to reach the siding. Percy's going to get." The way it is going to crash right into Gordon's train. <sighs> Why do I have to be delayed? Help! <gasps> the signal man was quick in action and switched the train before Percy could even rant and slight bump into Gordon. Ah! He soon derailed through the buffers which was unexpected thank goodness no one was hurt <laughs> oh no percy i'll get you into the works we have to hurry engine from the reports i heard it was your fault that you that you derailed no sir no sir i, I didn't mean to sir well i'm sorry Percy. the mail managers informed me that they do not want you to pull the mail train but what will happen to the mail train i'm sorry percy but they'll have to be scrapped no, sir. Hang in. Hang in, Percy. We had a good run. No, it's just not right. Come on. Come on, I'll take you to the scrapyard. But, sir, I'm sorry, Percy, but there's no other use of them. Uh. uh. Percy was soon fixed and left the works. Uh, I wonder what job I guess I'm going to be stuck on goods work. The troubles in the trucks are no good for me. Uh, there was an abandoned line. That's odd. Hey, Percy, watch it. Percy? Carly? Frank? Clive? It is you! What? But you, I thought you went to the scrapyard. Well, we did too, but somehow we were switched onto this line and we made it here. Thank goodness. Uh, Percy, can you get us out of here? Voices are speaking to us. Really? We should get you out of here. Uh, but the hill is so, but the incline's so steep. How are you supposed to get us out of here? I'll try. You did it, Percy, you did it. Great job, Percy. Who said that? 
I don't know. I don't. I have no idea who said that. Live. <sighs> Let's head back to the station and see what Sir Top and Pat wants to do with us. Percy, is that the mail cars? Yes, sir. Oh, thank goodness. The mail, the mail post manager said their lorries have broken down. They sent all their mail here for us to deliver. Really, sir? You'll have to take it. Okay, sir. I'll do my best. Come on, Carly. Come on, Carly, Clive, and Frank. Let's do this. Here, here, Percy. We're doing it. We're doing it. Great job. Percy soon made all his deliveries at excellence. Great job, said Sir Top and Pat. Percy, I am for a reward. I'd like I I like to give you a pair of coaches and have a new engine to take the mail on. Actually, sir, um, if it, if you may, but I don't want coaches. You don't, Percy. I like working with Frank, Clive, and Carly. They're what make me feel like I'm part. They look, make me feel like I'm pulling the express. Yes, sir. We would not want any other engine to pull us besides Percy. He's been treating us well ever since he arrived to the branch line. They're like Annie and Clarabelle to Thomas. They're like Annie and Clarabelle to Thomas. And Toby and Henrietta to... And they're like Henrietta to Toby. They're just what I... They just what make me feel unique. Very well, Percy. If that's what you wish. But we'll st still need a new engine to handle passenger work and goods work. Okay, sir. What does the top and pat mean about that? I don't know. So soon after, soon after, Percy got along well with his, with with the with the duo. Rain, snow, hail, or winds, this dynamic three truck duo can handle it all. But what did Sir Top and Pat mean about the other engine? Well, I would tell you more, but I'll spoil the next story.